Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today we're diving into the world of photography with a brand that's known for its incredible image quality and unique design. Yes, we're talking about Fujifilm. In this video, we're going to explore the best Fujifilm cameras of 2025. Whether you're a professional photographer or an enthusiast, there's something here for everyone. So let's get started. Number five, Fujifilm X-T5. The Fujifilm X-T5, which will be released in 2024, is the pinnacle of Fujifilm's X-series mirrorless cameras, integrating cutting-edge technology and refined craftsmanship for both professional and enthusiast photographers. The X-T5 boasts a cutting-edge sensor that produces great image quality with high resolution and impressive low-light performance. The sophisticated image processing engine ensures the superb color reproduction that has become familiar with Fujifilm. The X-T5's improved autofocus mechanism enables quick and accurate subject tracking, making it ideal for recording fast-paced action. The camera's burst shooting capabilities have been improved, giving photographers the speed they need to capture every moment. Recognizing the growing importance of video in modern photography, the X-T5 includes sophisticated video features such as high-quality 4K recording, faster frame rates, and professional-grade video settings, making it suitable for both stills and motion capture. The X-T5 builds on Fujifilm's famous vintage design, retaining a timeless look while introducing ergonomic changes for improved handling. Number 4 Fujifilm X-T30i The Fujifilm X-T30i is one of Fujifilm's top entry-level cameras. It employs the same sensor as the Fujifilm X-S20 and higher-end Fuges of its generation, such as the Fujifilm X-T4, so you can expect superb image quality right out of the box. The main distinction here is in design. The X-T30 QI is one of Fujifilm's most portable camera bodies with an extremely compact and lightweight design. Unlike the X-AS20, you also get exposure dials, giving you the old-school Fuji shooting experience that allows you to easily modify settings on the fly. Its tilting screen is especially useful for filming at waist level. It is far less expensive than the X-AS20, but its autofocus system is less reliable than that of recent generations of Fujifilm cameras. Nonetheless, this is one of the best Fujifilm cameras for novices or those looking for a portable camera for vacation or street photography. The Fujifilm X-T30 QI is a minor update of the Fujifilm X-T30. The X-T30 Q, like its predecessor, is an interchangeable lens mirrorless camera aimed at beginners looking to upgrade to a mid-range model. It's a small APS-C camera with more physical buttons and dials than the entry-level Fujifilm X-T200 and fills a great gap between the more compact Fujifilm X-E4 and the more video-oriented Fujifilm X-S10. The Fujifilm X-T30 Hi is an excellent travel camera. It has a tiny lightweight body that seems well-made and is easy to transport. JPEG photographs look great right out of the camera, with little noise and vibrant colors. While it features plenty of tactile dials and buttons for adjusting settings on the fly, its compact size can make it feel a little claustrophobic. It also has a limited battery life, albeit you can use it while charging via USB. The Fujifilm X-T30 Hi is an excellent landscape camera. It handles noise well for an APS-C sensor and RAW files have a reasonable level of exposure latitude, allowing you to make tweaks and restore shadow detail without sacrificing too much quality. Images look amazing straight out of the camera if you shoot in JPEG, and there are many film simulation settings to choose from to achieve a distinct appearance and feel. The camera also offers an HER option that uses in-camera processing to produce images with greater dynamic range. However, it isn't the most comfortable camera to use. The Fujifilm X-T30 Kai is sufficient for vlogging. It's small and lightweight, and when used with an optically stabilized Fuji lens, it does an outstanding job of smoothing out camera shake. The video quality is likewise excellent. However, you cannot rotate the screen to face you while filming and it overheats while utilizing the best video quality settings. There's also a lot of rolling shutter and fork, which might generate distracting skewed lines in your video's backgrounds. Number three, Fujifilm X-S20. The Fujifilm X-S20 is a fantastic hybrid camera for intermediate photographers. It's one of the best mid-range models available, having a wonderful combination of superior photo and video functions at a lesser price than the cameras described above. It's a more approachable alternative than the Fujifilm x 5 with a more traditional PSDM dial rather than separate control dials and a more portable design than the Fujifilm x 2 s offering the best of both worlds. It takes exceptional image quality despite using an older 4th generation 26 megapixel X-Trans sensor. It also has IBS for handheld shooting and fork recording up to 60 eps, albeit with some cropping. That's not bad for a camera at this pricing. If you're looking for something a little less expensive, the Fujifilm X-S10 is still a very good camera that will save you a few hundred dollars. Its video specs aren't as impressive, with internal recording limited to fork 30 eps and 8-bit, 
but it's a deal for people who don't require the most up-to-date video features. The Fujifilm X-S20 is an excellent travel camera. It boasts a compact and lightweight design that is ideal for travel, and its battery life is exceptional for a mirrorless camera. Aside from that, image quality is superb, with beautiful colors right out of the camera and film simulation profiles to experiment with the appearance and tone of your photos. Furthermore, its autofocus mechanism performs well, with a fantastic auto-subject detection mode that recognizes and tracks various types of targets automatically. However, there is no weather ceiling on the camera. Its viewfinder is likewise quite small. The Fujifilm X-S20 is an excellent landscape camera. Its sensor performs impressively for an APS-C sensor, with a surprising level of dynamic range to capture greater detail in high-contrast scenes and excellent low-light noise control. The camera is also well-made, somewhat portable, and easy to use. However, because it is not weather-sealed, you must exercise greater caution in inclement weather. The Fujifilm X-S20 is an excellent choice for studio video. It can internally record 4K-60 10-bit 4-2-2 video and even enables OpenGate 6.2 recording and raw video output via HDMI, making it a respectable mid-range video camera. The body's headphone jack also eliminates the requirement for a USB-C converter. On the other hand, it doesn't have the best heat management since it can overheat quickly in both the 6.2 and fork modes, though you can purchase an additional cooling fan adapter to aid with this. If necessary, you can extend the battery life by connecting the camera to an external power supply via USB-C. The Fujifilm X-S20 is an excellent travel camera. It boasts a compact and lightweight design that is ideal for travel, and its battery life is exceptional for a mirrorless camera. Aside from that, image quality is superb, with beautiful colors right out of the camera and film simulation profiles to experiment with the appearance and tone of your photos. Furthermore, its autofocus mechanism performs well, with a fantastic auto-subject detection mode that recognizes and tracks various types of targets automatically. However, there is no weather ceiling on the camera. Its viewfinder is likewise quite small. Number 2 Fujifilm X100V the Fujifilm X100V is a premium point-and-shoot camera with an APS-C sensor and the fifth edition of Fujifilm's X100 series of tiny cameras, which are popular among street photographers and enthusiasts worldwide. Fujifilm has kept all of the things that work about this formula, including a relatively compact body with a retro rangefinder design, dedicated exposure dials for hands-on control, and the piece de resistance, a hybrid viewfinder that lets you toggle between an optical viewfinder for easier framing and an electronic viewfinder for real-time exposure adjustments, while upgrading the lens from its predecessor. The Fujifilm X100V is an excellent travel camera. While the somewhat large for a point-and-shoot camera, its tiny fixed-lens design is far smaller than most interchangeable lens cameras, making it convenient to travel with. The camera's image quality is great right out of the box, and it performs well in low light thanks to a high ISO performance and a wide aperture lens. On bright days, you can use a larger aperture or slower shutter speed because the lens has an ND filter built in. Its fixed 35mm equivalent focal length forces you to wander about to properly compose your photographs, which some people prefer, but it isn't as adaptable as a fixed zoom lens for distant objects. Unfortunately, the camera's narrow hand grip makes it uncomfortable to use. Unless you acquire supplementary sealing devices for its lens, it is not fully weather sealed. The Fujifilm X100V is an excellent landscape camera. The image quality out of the box is outstanding, with excellent noise handling and a wide dynamic range for capturing more detail in high contrast landscapes. The camera is also well built and somewhat weather sealed, while full weather sealing requires the purchase of additional components. The lens's built-in ND filter allows you to enlarge the aperture or slow down the shutter speed in bright conditions. Unfortunately, the camera isn't particularly comfortable, but its small size and lightweight make it ideal for taking on hikes or to distant shooting spots. The Fujifilm X100V is adequate for studio video. Although it is primarily designed for photography, not video, the video quality in fork and 1080p is excellent, with clearly drawn details and vibrant colors. It enables log recording to capture a greater dynamic range in video. And in addition to F-Log, it has a large selection of film simulation profiles if you'd like to customize the look of your videos and camera. Number 1. Fujifilm X-A2S The Fujifilm X-A2S is one of the most impressive Fujifilm cameras we've ever examined. This flagship model foregoes several of Fujifilm's trademark features, such as specialized exposure control dials and a small body. It is, nevertheless, a hybrid powerhouse with a lot to offer pros and enthusiasts, such as a durable weather seal design and superb ergonomics. The 26-megapixel stack sensor, on the other hand, provides a faster readout speed for faster burst shooting and less rolling shutter effect.
Mais, there concludes our top five best Fujifilm cameras of 2025 list. All product links are in the description, which is updated with the lowest prices. Subscribe to our channel for more videos. Until then, we'll see you in the next video.